Fountain School have been involved with the Kingfish project for over three years. They've supported our students with work experience and we've been involved in many other projects. We were approached by Dawn Maddins to get involved with this uh, project. So we've had different groups of students coming down here, uh, collecting bottles, assembling the greenhouse, washing the bottles and doing uh, everything that's involved. I'm Aaron Stringer, I work for Trendal Vazen as a volunteer coordinator. Right, the actual process of the, actually building the greenhouse is the fact that we actually put the bottles onto the canes, then we attach the canes onto the actual frames, uh, then we attach the frames onto the post, which will build the sides and the back and the front, and then we actually put the roof on afterwards. We actually originally planned to use 1,500 plastic two-litre bottles. Uh, we actually changed that because of the actual dimensions of the greenhouse, we made it smaller. So, so far up to date, we've used 1,100 plastic bottles. The actual plastic bottles make a really good effective uh, greenhouse due to the fact is that you actually put one bottle inside of another bottle on the actual canes, which means it's twice the amount of heat in the greenhouse. My name's Bev Rowley. I'm lead teacher uh, for the sixth form at Fountains High School, which is a generic special school in uh, Streatham. Well, the, the pupils benefit greatly from working in the community. It's given them lots of experience of um, vocational type activities and getting them ready for the, work, the real working world. And it also fits in with some of the work we're doing in school about improving the environment. Well, we're going to continue working with the Kingfish Project, but we're also hoping to build a replica of this greenhouse in the school grounds so that the students can have that experience of growing their own vegetables. And we've also got an allotment so we can be planting things out down there. I'm John Jackson and I'm the chairman of Trent and Dove Housing Association in Burton-on-Trent. It's a joint venture between Trent and Dove Housing, the Kingfisher Trust, uh, the school, uh, and we are funding it as part of our uh, social uh, affairs uh, support in Burton-on-Trent. We don't believe in building houses, we build communities. And this is very much a part of a community project. It's a great joy to us that we're working with the school because it benefits the pupils there and gets them into an environment which perhaps they otherwise wouldn't enter increases interest that people take in their properties and of course we're responding to the government's initiative that we should all be a tiny bit greener. What, what have you been able to do? Getting my more independence and helping the environment out and all that. Um, I have learnt like recycling like waste, how we can like be more eco-friendly and build like a greenhouse just like the greenhouse at the back of me and like we can use like recyclable like materials and put together and make something much useful for towards the environment. Takes a lot of bottle to do a job like this. <laughs> <laughs>